So I'm going to read it. Yeah, so Can you wait to read the dream or do you want to wait for Pierre? I want to wait for Pierre to, to tell me what he so wants me to do. Okay. Yeah, but I'll, I'll read it read for it. sure. I like I like somebody to tell me what I'm supposed to do. Read it. Read it. Read it. Go ahead and read it. Yes. Okay. I'm gonna start reading it then. I'm in a house with some people. Looks like Pierre's gonna do. Okay. Sorry. He looks like he's going to give some drama. Okay. Oh, okay. Okay. So, well, yeah, he's. I was wrong. I thought he was sketching. Uh, waiting was the correct response. I was. I should have just stuck with, right? Yeah. <laughs> you were right. Anyone else? <laughs> yeah. Okay. Yeah, he wants me to divide it and stuff like that. <laughs> Better divide it. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. True that. Maria, sometimes people teach the way they were taught. And mm. that can be Okay. Okay. As you look it over, <clears throat> make the divisions in it. Have you given out all the copies you have? Yes. Okay. I made ten. Ah, okay. I just read it. Thank you. Good. Okay. Okay. Does it appear that some of the divisions are more important than others? Go ahead and start reading it. 
Okay. Yeah. Ready? Yep. Read it out loud, please. Okay. I'm in a house with some people. We seem to be hiding out from something. My daughter hears a noise coming from the door in the back of the room. She asks me a question about the noise, as she seems to be concerned about it. I tell her to be quiet, as I don't want whatever it is where we are hiding from to hear her. A man who is close to the door checks out the noise. The guy is a character from the show The Dead, Walking Dead. As he's doing this, I notice that the door is only a screen door. So he goes outside to check things out. I notice that there is a tree outside with pods in it that have zombies and bears in them. I also notice that people are walking, riding bikes, and running around this tree. All this time, nothing is happening to them. Dream ends. Hmm. What am I going to ask? Um, was it a failure or success? Was it a failure or success? Um, I don't know. It doesn't seem to have um, an ending. Mm -hmm. Okay. Is there any particular part you would focus on? Um, well, I was, cur I was curious about why I have this feeling that um, I should be hiding away in this house, but as I go outside to look at things, it doesn't really seem like there's a real fear. No, no, sure. Read the first part again. I'm in a house with some people. <coughs> Seem to be hiding out from something. <coughs> Keep going. That's enough. Okay. What's that like in the dream? In the dream, I'm I'm scared. I'm scared. Um, I I have fear. I remember I have fear. Uh, what degree? Tense. Intense. Yeah. No, no. Okay. Um, what is it like when I tell her to be quiet? Um, my fear uh, uh, goes up again. It goes up higher than it was before. More. Yeah. Because I don't want whatever it is we're hiding from to hear us. Right. Yeah. Good. Especially, I don't want her to, him to, right. it to hear her because yeah. that's my daughter. Yeah. yeah. So I'm in protective mode. Yeah. Next part. Um. um my daughter hears a noise coming from the door in the back of the room. Mm -hmm. Keep going. Yeah. Um, she asked me a question about the noise as she seems to be concerned about it. Mm -hmm. Keep going. Yes. I tell her to be quiet as I don't want whatever it is we are hiding from to is hear that her. that increases the fear? Yes. Right? Yes. Okay, good, good. Now, second. Mm. Go ahead, a man. A man who is close to the door checks out the noise. The guy is a character from the show The Walking Dead. As he's doing this, I notice that the door is only a screen door. So he goes outside to check things out. That's all. What's it like? when you notice that the door is only a screen door? I was like, almost like, um, I don't know if, the, if it's a good word, flabbergasted, like, like all this time we were hiding and it's just a screen door that's like between us and whatever we're hiding from. Like, I couldn't believe it. Finish like, it, I couldn't um, believe what? I couldn't believe that, that we were hiding 
from whatever we were hiding from when it was easily, when they, whatever, whatever we were hiding from was easily being able to come in. Yes, he, he, he could see through it. Right. Ah. Or they could, could, could easily just come in. Right. Easy to come in. Right. 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 Easy to come in and maybe visible. Oh, yeah. I oh, mean, if you got oh. close enough, yeah, you could probably see inside. Thank you. That's very important. What was that like then? Uh, for you? Yeah, I just was like, I couldn't believe it. I was like almost dumbfounded. Um, like, wow, all this time we're hiding out in this place and whatever's trying to come and get us is, would easily be able to come and get us. I was just like, whoa, I couldn't believe it. Good, 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 good. Um, I like that. Um, what does it mean for you that this man is a member or in some way uh, the guy is a character from the show The Walking Dead? What does that mean for you in the dream? That um, was telling me that um, that whatever we're hiding from were zombies. Was it? Was a zombie or zombies? Ah, oh, so that told you. Ah, right. Right. Good. All right. What did that do to you? Um, that even made me more like, uh, like, like dumbfounded, even more so than I was before. Like, oh my God! Like these things could have just come in at any moment and just taken over us uh, with no problem whatsoever. Good, good. Okay, um, next part. So he goes outside to check things out. I notice that there is a tree outside with pods in it that have zombies and bears in them. What's that like? <laughs> it's like, I was like, almost like, wow. It's, not, it's bad enough that there's zombies in these pods, but there's also bears. It's like, it's a double threat. Good. Go ahead. Um, I also noticed that people are walking, riding bikes, and running around this tree. See, that's a set different. Um, how do they look? They look like they're just out, you know, on a, on a Saturday, Sunday, just enjoying themselves, having a good time, exercising. Like nothing's going on, nothing's wrong, everything is fine, um, everything is great. It's a nice, beautiful day, you know, and they're just enjoying it. What did that do to you? I was just even more like, whoa, like what is going on here? I was even more flabbergasted than I even started out to be. What, what do you mean by that? Like, um, like taken back, like, um, like this isn't possible, there's something off about this. Why are all these people, don't they see the danger? That's important. In the dream. Yes. Right? Yes. Because I obviously could see the pods, I was wondering why they couldn't see them. <clears throat> And all this time, nothing happens. Nothing happens to them, like, nothing. Yeah, yeah. Yeah. What, what happened then to you? Uh, all this time, then nothing happens. Yeah, I, was, I, I woke up wondering, like, was I even supposed to be afraid? Say it again. Watch. I woke up and was wondering to myself, was I even supposed to be afraid? Yeah, that's when you woke up. Right. And you reflect on the dream, yeah. and you're saying, Hey, then why am I 
Afraid. Afraid. Right. Yeah. Right. Yeah. Like I, yeah, it seemed like I was the only one. Uh, well, except for the people that were in the house, that all these other people were just, you know, like la la la, you know, like yeah. it's just a like, normal day. Like, yeah. If they're right. Yeah. What's wrong with me? Right. <laughs> right. <laughs> right. Yeah. Um, yeah. It was. It was. It was curious to me. Like. Why was I in this state of mind, and these people are just going around like, you know, oh, you know, whoop a dee doo. This is a great day. Nothing to worry about. Yeah. Notice the uh, uh, first two sentences. Right. Read it again. I'm in a house with some people. We seem to be hiding out from something. Right. So you have the fear right from the beginning yes. before all of this develops. Yes. Yes. Right. Yeah, yeah. And it seems like the fear intensifies. Yeah. Yeah. And then and then all this and then all of a sudden I'm seeing these people just walking around like it's just an everyday Sunday afternoon, nothing wrong, and I'm just like, okay. Yeah. 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 Why well, am I afraid? Yeah. Well, that's so, what I woke up thinking. In terms of the dream, then, you came in with the fear. Yes. Yes. Right. So, could you add more words to those first two sentences? There is some... When, when I'm trying to remember the dream, there's some, there was something that made me feel this way, like the, the, like the mindset of the people that were there, the mindset of, of how everybody was there, um, they all seem to be like, like you know, hovering and, and scared like me, um, and they were all quiet. And so there was like this, 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 this in the air type of thing where they were all afraid. So like their fear was almost like fueling my fear. Mm. They're all quiet. They're all they're all in that state. Yeah, and they're that all seem in that state to of contribute mind. To yeah, my state of mind. Your state. Yeah. Yeah, 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 yeah. yeah. Could you add more to that? It's very interesting, right? Like it's like it's contagious in some way. <laughs> yeah, yeah, yeah. It's like contagious very much so. Um, I'm trying to remember because this is Saturday, the stream. Um, It was just like like they were all like 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 together like um, you know like in that 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 uh, panic state of mind like huddling together. Um, and um, you know they're all quiet and trying to not make noise. Um, And uh, yeah, and it's just their state of mind is like going onto my yeah. state of mind. And that had an Im impact on you. Mm -hmm. Yeah. Mm. But then I realized there's nothing to be afraid of at the end. Yeah, yeah. <clears throat> Do you find that rather uh, interesting that uh, you're picking up or going along with the panic that they are experiencing? I don't like being there. Hmm? I don't like being there. I don't like being in that panic. I agree, but we're interested in the dream, right? Um. Like that's a, that's a, that's having an effect on you. Yes. Right. Yes. And you don't like being in that state, no. or no, or feeding off of their state, or feeding off them. Right. Right. right? That's a good expression. Mm -hmm. Feeding off them. Yeah. Um. Uh, could you put more words? That's a great expression, uh, feeding off them. And you don't like it, you like, mm. don't like doing it. No. Right? right. Um, it's a very, 
non um, like you, like this this type of state of mind you you can't like like go past it. It's like you're stuck there. Yeah, yeah, um, yeah, yeah, you're yeah, yeah, yeah. Like um, like you're almost a prisoner of it. That's like what? You're a prisoner. If that's your opinion. A prisoner. You're a prisoner. A prisoner. You're a prisoner. Right, yeah, right, 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 right. Caught, right? Yeah, you're caught up in it, yeah. Yeah. <coughs> yeah. Now, that's an old feeling, isn't it? Yeah, very much so. Yeah, it's been around for a while. Yes. What yeah. am I going to ask you? Where did it start? <laughs> yeah. We're going to have that discussion later, right? <laughs> yeah, okay. All right. And you have to answer the question, do you want to go there? Do you want to pursue that? Not tonight. Not today. Yeah. Yeah, that's your right. 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 But so you're carrying that from the past. Yes. What's interesting about it is the way you're putting it is very important. This kind of fear, you're feeding off of others. You don't <laughs> like it. No, I don't. But it's like you're caught in it and, as it were, like a prisoner, mm. right? And then all of this follows. But it looks like there's no reason to yeah. Well, my dream master has been telling me this since yeah. my first zombie yeah. dream, not to be afraid. Yeah. 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 And I'm just wondering why it's coming up again. Yeah. Yeah. Here. So, please. Go, go. I interrupted you. Go ahead. I was wondering why it's coming up again because my, my dream master in my last zombie dream was telling me not to be afraid. And it's, but it's coming up again. And it's saying again. Yeah, There's don't no be afraid. Reason. Yeah. Don't, there's no reason to be afraid. But we're saying, hey, you got to go to find out where it comes from. To stop the fear? Yeah. Okay. Yeah. And if you want to do that some other time, yeah, we, we can do it. Okay. Yeah. Let's do it. Yes, please. I was just wondering, is it worth it to ask uh, about the guy more? The character from The Walking Dead? Like... He's just, he's a character that you would associate with that show. That, In what um, way? That... Back. He's a no. He's a good guy. And he's you, trying to protect people. And you linked it up with, with the, zombie. the zombies. Yes, that, I think that's the important part. Is he's trying to protect part. people. He's a good guy. Yeah. Well, you, like from the show mm -hmm. Walking Dead. I've never really watched the show, but from what I've heard about it and what I've the little like scenes I've seen, I've, mm -hmm. he's a good guy. Well, and also, but in the dream, he goes outside to check things out. Right, because right. yes. he's because he's the good he, guy. His going outside to check things out. I don't know what what kind of people do that, but <laughs> it precipitates her seeing what's outside. Right. Oh, yeah, that's interesting. So that was helpful. <clears throat> that was, yeah, he's yeah. helped me to see Let's what's going on. Let's look at the next on. one. Yeah, he's helping me. Interesting. Yeah. Stay there. <laughs> oh. <laughs> Please. Okay. I was playing with some elements, one of which was love. Love seemed to be an important element. It sparkled and shined no matter where I placed it, in the many lines of elements. So this one was more of a, um, of, of a symbolized, like, I, like, it's just like I remember doing it. It's not like a, it had any much, like, yeah, yeah, um, yeah. It's in you. Yeah. In. Well, like, um, Go ahead. I just remember doing it, you know? Yeah, you're moving your hands. Yeah, I'm moving, like, there's a bunch of lines of elements, um, different ones, several different ones. And I was taking, like, love kept, kept, uh, kept getting my attention because it was sparkly and shiny. So it kept getting my attention. So I would take it and I would move it to, down to another um, line of elements and it would still sparkle and shine. And then I would move it to another uh, line of elements and it would still sparkle and shine and I would move it again 
and it would still sparkle and shine. Nothing I did, no matter where I moved it, no matter where I placed it, it sparkled and shined. Oh, I don't know that word. Could you talk about it? Uh, it was like, um, well, I, I was thinking it reminded me of the myth of Ur, like um, where uh, there's these, these, these um, uh, God, what are they called? You can either choose this lot or this lot, and, or the lots in between, and the lots on the ends were like sparkling, shiny, and, but you're not supposed to choose those. You're supposed to choose the ones in the middle. It sort of reminded me of that. Yeah. Yeah. Um, if you were to paint it, uh, finish it. Um, what it was, colors would you use? Uh, red. Red, go ahead. Um, like a diamond. Um, like a diamond? Yeah. Right. Um, but there was like a, like a bunch of diamonds. Like, like a, a bunch, bunch of them? Yeah, okay. a bunch of diamonds. Um, and what, they're all shining? Yes. It's like a, like, yeah, like almost like fireworks too. Like fireworks? Yeah. Uh, by the way, what did it do to you? Hmm? What did it do to you? It, uh, it, it, it was like, I couldn't believe, like, no matter where I put it, it nothing faced it. It would just still sparkle and shine no matter yeah. where I was putting it. And uh, it was very fascinating to me that, like, I could, like, no matter where I was placing it, it would not stop sparkling and yeah, shining. Yeah. Must have been dull. No, it was beautiful. Well, help me out. It was beautiful. Oh, it was, uh, a um, little bit? No, a lot. Uh, I, that's why I kept getting my attention, because it was so beautiful. Um, among the things you've seen in the past that are beautiful, where would you put all high. those? Way high. Up? High, yeah. Yeah, yeah. Uh, what was it like being in the middle of it? Um, it was, it was like, wow. It was beautiful. It was, um... Is I like being in this state of mind way better than the other. Um, oh yeah, yeah, yeah. Uh, <laughs> um, it just like came natural. It was, it was, um, it was. I didn't have to think about anything. It was just flowed. Um, it, I felt safe. Um, I felt happy. How much? Oh, it's high, 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 high. Bliss. Um, yeah, blissful. It was blissful. Yes. Um, I just, yeah, I like being in this state of mind way better. Um, what was it like then? Wherever you looked, it appeared beautiful. What did that do to you? It, it just, um, I kept like thinking to myself, like, I, like I couldn't, like almost like I didn't believe it, but yet I did. It's like, um, um, like I, like I couldn't believe, like, um, like no matter where I put it, it didn't, um, like, stunt its shining, um, or like affected it in any way, but yet it made sense to me that it wouldn't. Yeah, yeah, that's good. What does that mean? Made sense that it would be this way? Um, well, because of what we've been reading lately with the family, um, we've been reading Plotinus' uh, commentary on the Timaeus. Um, it, it fits with what Timaeus says a lot. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Or the other guy. Yeah. Yeah. Thank, you. Thank you. Thank you. Right. <coughs> Might as well go home. <laughs> Sorry, was that an enlightenment? What was the conclusion? 
I, I didn't. You so, do it. Satori. Go ahead. This is an enlightenment experience. Okay. Of some kind. It looks like it, doesn't it? Yeah. 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 <laughs> yeah. You know. You know how we can tell? Ask David. Well, you certainly have uh, the factor of a very deep participation. And beauty and mm -hmm. together with love. And, and as, Wherever you look, and especially in each of the elements, each yeah. of the human beings and the yeah, and you and you look for the self affirmation that's in it. Yes, thank you. See? That's just what I was writing down. See, it overcame this. See, like I didn't believe it, so I had to wherever it was. So, Belinda, it it brought about a self affirmation, didn't it? Yeah. That, that has to be there, or it ain't real. Fine. So that's very right up there. So if any of you want to borrow her pillow. No, no. <laughs> no, she's saying that her and her family have been studying. Uh, the commentary on the Timaeus. Proclus's commentary on the Timaeus. Is that one of those ancient things? Well, I don't think it's a magic <laughs> pill, but it might be something. I like mean, that's pretty high up there, yeah, isn't yeah, it? Maybe it is. Uh, it's a curious family. I know yeah, a couple of them. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> the wrong one. Take a minute out. Oh, yeah. Hey. Okay, who needs more time? <coughs> okay, all right, all right. Who yeah. needs any more? <coughs> More time, hold on. Everything okay? Okay.
I'm at my parents' house. My dad is sitting with a couple of Bosnian friends, and I'm sitting there too, in the living room. There is some kind of foreign woman there as well, in the dining area. The guys are talking, talking. One of them supposedly came to pick up the foreign woman to help him carry something over to his house, or the other way around. There's a pizza on the table and I grab a slice. My dad leaves the room. One of the Bosnians offers me some pizza and I say that I already had some. You did? Yeah, I had some while you were talking. He tries to get the foreign woman to help with the table and for some reason he can't. He gets upset because this is the second time he's come over and hasn't been able to get his job done. He's walking out the door. I'm looking at the clock and thinking, I have some time, I have like an hour. I think I'll go help him. I'm following him out the door, but I forgot what his name is, so I asked the other Bosnian, what's his name again? He says it's Balia. I go outside and I go, Balia! He turns around um, and I say, if you want, I can help you with the table. And he's like, nah, I hurt my back, I can't do it today. And I'm thinking, what? Was he just pretending to be upset? He never wanted to do it in the first place. I'm like, uh, okay. And I go back inside. I'm just kind of sitting there. That's it. Right. Those three fit together, do they not? What do you see as significant in those first three paragraphs? Okay. What do you find significant in the first three paragraphs in the dream? Um, that the man came over to get the table, but like he's he's pretending to. To, to come and get the table, mm -hmm. but mm -hmm. he actually didn't want to get it at all. <coughs> yeah. What is it like in the dream when you see that? It's like, um, like what's going on here? Uh, what? More. Uh, what is he up to? Like, well, like, what's what's the meaning of this game? It's a bit. It's a bit annoying. Annoying. It's a bit annoying. More. More. Yeah. To think that, come on. Um, just the whole, um, the whole charade. More. What do you call it? Um, yeah, it's, it's charade. It's like. Uh, Go ahead. It's just fake. Um, It, it just um, f it feels like one of those things that's like, uh, it's hard to put words on it. It's like, um, uh, I, I, like I can tell that his motivation for doing that is not good. And it's kind of stinks. It stinks. <laughs> uh, 
in this. Yeah. Uh, what do you think of your seeing at that moment? Um, it's it's fine. Yeah, yeah. yeah. What do you do with your sin? Nothing. I just go. Oh. I go back. Oh, what's that like? You say, oh, okay. Um. Go ahead. Oh yeah. Um, yeah. Go ahead. It, it it would have been good if I challenged him. It's like, what, what do you? Why are you? Well, what's it like when you in the uh, dream when you said, "Oh, okay." Well, I, I feel a bit um, a bit tricked. Um, it's like. <laughs> Like I was putting in a bit of effort to help him, and it it, it was um, um, it felt it, it was like it felt empty somehow, like um, disappointing. Yeah, yeah, true. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Uh, you mentioned. Did you have the idea that you might have said something, but no, didn't? No, not in the dream. Not in the dream. Not so in the dream. Yeah. That wasn't in the dream. No, I just kind so of. So, when you say "okay" in the dream, what does that mean then? Uh, it's like. I mean, of, it's kind of like I, I give up, or I give up. Right? I'm, I'm going to retreat. It, <laughs> there's nothing to do here. Ah, right. I give up. Yeah. Nothing to do here. Like I, I, I just lose interest. I lose interest. Lose interest. Like, it seems pointless. Yeah. Yeah. Uh, I, I give up. I give up. Maybe a bit strong. It's more like I give up on the situation. Yeah, what's that like? It's just um, meaningless. It's kind of like, uh, um, what is it like? Oh, okay. It's it's pretty annoying actually. Yeah, yeah, yeah. That it's, comes up again, doesn't it? Yeah. It's a it's a waste of time. Yeah, yeah. <coughs> I don't like wasting time. Yeah, sure, sure. Um. Why is that like the next section with the vacuum cleaner? Um. Well, my mom doesn't specify uh, what's wrong with the vacuum cleaner? So I go and I just do like a general maintenance on it. It's, it's just ridiculous. It's like um, what's similar to that in the first part? Um, it may just be a waste of time as well. Oh, same thing. Yeah. It's all right. Yeah. A lot of these words might fit. Um, tricked. Does yeah. the boys see it? <laughs> Maybe he does, yeah, because he's like, what's Elda doing? <laughs> <laughs> At he's least. dancing. Yeah. 
It's it's as if she's just making me dance. Oh. He's dancing. Kid is doing some good singing. <laughs> Smart kid. Not yeah. right? Yeah. No. Oh. Uh, would you agree you have another paragraph? How is that similar? Come on. Uh, I also ask her... Um, yeah, okay. Um, is there some issue going on in the same way? It has the same kind of... Um, What's different in it? it? It's more personal. More? Uh, it's... Uh, I recognize that I'm doing that thing as well. Uh, Look here. She this is all going on, so let me ask you. In terms of the dream, what's it like? Uh, yeah, yeah. You partly do everything. You partly have friends. You partly involved in things. I'm getting louder. What are you doing at that moment? It's like uh, venting, but I'm like, I'm kind of, I'm letting her have it. Uh, I, I, I agree with you, but I'd like to know what that means when you say you're letting her have it. Um, I'm telling her what I think. Yeah, yeah, good. And um, Right, right, you're telling her what you think. What's that like? Well, this was kind of it was a it was a release. It was like uh, something I've wanted to tell her. Um, it's like um, it's it's good. It's good because I'm I'm standing up to her. It's it's kind of like what was missing in the first part. Right, right, um, right. This is therefore a big shift from the other two. Yeah. Right? Now you're putting into words, aren't you? Right? Yeah, and it's, it's really coming out. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Um, but look what it... Okay? <clears throat> Try this. I'm thinking. Read it from there. Wow. Okay, could you go from there? I'm thinking... Uh, Hold it. Yeah, go ahead. I'm hearing this sound. Yeah. And I'm thinking, wow, is this like some kind of cosmic sound? Because I'm challenging my mother? It's a buzzing, didgeridoo, echo like sound. Mm -hmm. It sounds like the sound of the cosmos. Call it a cosmic sound, don't you? Yeah. What's that like experiencing that? It's amazing. It's amazing. It's more, like more, more. It's like everything is buzzing with aliveness. Um, if if um, it, it's uh, you need more words. I don't. Know. Let me help you. Okay. It was pretty dull. No. What? It was. Um, it was. Thrilling. Thrilling? Yeah, exciting. Oh, a little bit. Extremely thrilling. It was oh, like... Oh, extremely thrilling. It was like... Go ahead. It was like this... Like... Nature's orchestra or something. Like 
What happened? Like, mm -hmm. like uh, uh, the orchestra of nature or something like that. Yeah, uh, put other words on it. Say the same thing, use other words. Come on. Um, uh, it was like... Um, it, it was like the cosmos was singing. Oh, oh, oh. Off, off, of course, off tune. <laughs> huh? Is that right? Do I have it right? <laughs> no, it was, it was beautifully... What? It was beautifully on pitch oh, beautiful. and like... Oh. <laughs> on pitch. Oh. Um, but uh, dull. No, it was... It was wonderful. It was like oh, wonderful. It was um. It, it was like it was it was saturating everything. Everything was saturated with that sound and experience. Like it was everywhere. Yeah. Therefore, it was pretty boring. No. You, you go ahead. It was pretty like a once in a lifetime kind of. Oh, in what uh, way? Uh, how to make you feel about yourself? Oh, really, really good. What? Really, really good. Really, like... really good. Oh, oh, oh! Because you were finally able to do what? Stand up to my mother. Ah. Oh. Ah. <laughs> oh. Ah. Oh. Now read the last paragraph with that in mind. Her face is very serious and she's looking at me upset. I basically tell her what I think her problem is. She's standing in front of me. Then I tell her, well, I don't know about you, but I figured out that that is my problem. That's who I am. That's what I'm dealing with. As I say that, she gets violent. She throws some glass bowl that's on the table at me. I kind of catch it and block it. She goes to lift up the glass yeah. table. What's it like? But I figured out that. Go ahead. Read that part again. I figured out that that is my problem. What's that like? It's really, um, it's really satisfying. And I'm kind of like, I'm standing my ground. Mm -hmm. I'm saying that I recognize that this is um, the, the drama that I play out, and... Uh, no. Is this the drama I am playing out? That's good. We need to know what it refers to. Oh, it refers to... Um, Normally, you would go along with it? With what? With whatever it is she's doing? Look, look here. But I figured out, well, that's, that is my problem. All right? You mean her problem is your problem, or you're seeing through her problem, or you're seeing, tell me. Okay, it's, it's pretty much all, all of those. No, it's, I, it, I can't roll, do it, do it. Um, well, the thing that I'm pointing out in her yeah. that I'm telling her is her problem. I'm also recognizing that it's my problem ah. and that uh, I accept that it's my problem, unlike her. Um, and uh, Then you're seeing into the nature of your life, your yeah, problem. Yeah, of this belief and this, this problem. But look here, if you're dealing with her and that's your problem, finish it. Uh, we have the same problem. Um, well, um, well, maybe I, uh, maybe it was it was harsh for me to give it to her like that, because it was really. I mean, it 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 may, it may it may be true that that's her problem, but. 
That doesn't mean I should have told her in that way. Yeah, that's probably true. But, but it, let's get back to the issue. <clears throat> what? Like you're revealing something to her as well, are you not? Yeah. Hey, Mom. Yeah. Right? Look at that line. Well, I don't know <clears throat> about you, but... <clears throat> I figured out that's my problem. It's so, like, I don't know what you're going to do about this, but I know what I'm going to do. Yeah. I'm going to work on this problem. So you're seeing her, your problem in her problem. Yeah. But look what it did to you to see it. Yeah. It really... Um, opened me up to this, this experience. So you're challenging your mother, are you also challenging yourself? Or are you seeing through her problem. We have to know what that means, you see. So you, it has to be in your dream. So at that moment, uh, when you say, that's who I am, that's what I'm dealing with, see, that is what I am dealing with is in the present, in the dream. Mm -hmm. hey, that's what I'm dealing with now. Mm -hmm. Is that the force of it? Yeah, it is. It's kind of like uh, by me saying it and standing up to her, in that moment I'm also kind of dishing it up for both of us. Mm -hmm. I'm saying, okay, this is what it is and I'm going to, I plan on, I'm going to deal with this. This is what I'm dealing with. And he, I'm also giving it to her, yeah. but to myself as well. Yeah. And in seeing that, you get into this state. Right. It, it, th through um, through uh, challenging her and saying what I see. Yeah. Um, yeah. See. So, the uh, question we're on is what effect does this experience of the cosmic sound have on you in the end when you're telling your mother hey, your problem is the same problem that I'm dealing with now. So you had this experience, right? When you're able to deal with her, which is also your problem, you're in this state. Yeah. It, it was like I was getting out of it as I was saying it and yeah. as I was experiencing that. Yeah. It's like moving out of that into that. Yeah, that's right. <laughs> <laughs> Well, in it, you're getting out of it. And this is what it's like getting out of it. <laughs> and you recognize, hey, your problem is my problem. You found your teacher. My, my teacher? Your mother. Her problem? Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. <laughs> uh, that's a good alternative. Yeah. See what we're lingering with? What the last statement you just made? Um, if, I, if I'm not 
in that problem, then I'm open to... In terms of the dream, so you were still in the dream. This is what you experienced telling her, but you recognize that's also your problem. But in this, is there any sense of being in her problem? No. 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 Once that hits, no. No. <clears throat> so we're being very cautious about this one issue, are we not? Which? Which is at this moment, were you seeing through your problem, or was this the discovery of recognizing that the problem she has, you have, and that produced this? Or did you, in seeing, being able to voice this to your mother, put you in this state, but now you have to deal with the problem, or did this eliminate the problem? See, all of those possibilities, you have to answer in the dream, not only. In the dream. Well, um, as I was speaking, mm -hmm. um, it, that experience was growing. Mm -hmm. Oh, good. So, um, as I was addressing her... It's growing throughout? Keep going. Th throughout my... Um, throughout the dream? No, throughout me telling her what I think. Yes. My, my okay. speech or my statement. Okay. Good. Um, as the speech progresses, uh, the state grows and the sound grows larger and more beautiful. Uh, so I, um, I'm, I'm definitely, um, Like, I, I don't know how to answer the question of am I getting, am I eliminating my problem or am I getting into the state because I'm stating the problem? Because the language in that third part is present. That's what I'm dealing with, right? That's what I'm dealing with. Oh, that's who I am. Yeah, by that in the dream, I meant that's my self-image, or that's my belief, or oh. that's what I meant in the dream. Yeah, um, that's who I am. So it it is. Um, I think I'm I'm like uh, as far as I uh, understand my problem in the dream. That's how much I'm out of it, mm -hmm. but um, I, I think that there's more mm -hmm. to 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 see mm -hmm. in the dream. When I'm in the dream, I also realize that there is a um, thing that I need to deal with mm -hmm. in the future. Mm -hmm. um, like there's more to it than mm -hmm. I've just said. Okay, then it's a liberating experience mm -hmm. to be able to deal with your mother directly. It puts you in this state of mind. But now you realize that now I'm going to have to deal with me. Yeah. Is that the way it goes? Yeah. Yeah. Because uh, we don't have to conclude. This is a possibility. And therefore, the next couple of dreams will be interested in seeing which way it goes. Yeah, for sure. Yeah, because it's very profound to say it. And that's what happens when you're able to say what's most important to you, to the person who's your teacher. Yeah. There, there was a damn good stay, right? right? Good, good, good. 
Yeah. Um, I have just a few questions, a few things I want to point out. That um, it seems like in the conclusion, the second to last paragraph, mm -hmm. there's a sense of strong resolution. Is that true? Or that there's something that, well, I'm challenging my mother, and that's, you've come to a state where you see what it is mm -hmm. that um, bring, uh, brings about that buzzing sense. Mm -hmm. Yeah, there's definitely a strong sense of resolution. Yeah. Okay. Uh, but what I'm wondering is, is that strong resolution a result of seeing the dynamics in the first two parts of the dream? Um, or Here I ask the same question. Uh, is there something in the dream that presents itself as a way of understanding challenging your mother? Let me put it in another way. Is there a dynamic going on here that might suggest a pathologos way of thinking? that might be pointed out in the first two sections that bring you to that state. In other words, is there more to see in this dream about the characters and the dynamic? Yeah, it, it, definitely, yes. The mm -hmm. dynamics of the first two scenarios are um, very, very similar. Yeah, I see them all identical. In fact, self-informative, inter-informative, sort of. Yeah, yeah. It's mm -hmm. it's almost like um, having gone through those. It's like I'm like, I, it's kind of like I've had enough, and then I, and I'm just like, then I tell her. Okay. It's like I w the, those situations set me up for the. That's good. For the insight. Good. Good. So it's, it's it's the actual resolution mm -hmm. of these things while you're in them mm -hmm. that brings you to, so there's a way of, of, of liberating yourself to accept the possibility of challenging your mother all the time, constantly. Yeah. Good. Yeah. Thank you. Good? Good? Yeah, thank Very you. Well. Good. Going once? Twice? Thank you. Thank you. Any more? I wish, but um, let's get on with it. Yep. Where's her dreams? Where's her dreams? She's, she's, uh, she has stage fright. She says she doesn't want to do it when she has stage fright. Mm. But there's no stage. <laughs> <laughs> Thank you. Fun. Okay, let's take a break, and then we come back and do some work.